I mean, it can be really fun and it can be really uh, annoying because everyone picks on the rookies. <laughs> so, you know, on a team with uh, Tony Kanan and Scott Dixon and Charlie, they make me go buy uh, some soda for like the veterans and stuff like Dixon and Kanan. Kanan's always like, hey, Dixon wants a soda, rookie, go buy him one. And I actually go, gotta go buy him sodas and stuff, which is funny, but he knows when we gotta go to business, we go to business. On and off the course, you know, we're all friendly, more so off the course. Uh, on the course, you know, we race each other pretty hard, keep as clean as possible. Whether you're 20 years old or 40 years old, you're all doing the same job and you all kind of have respect. To take on the track, it's what you need. You need to respect the guy you're driving with. If you're going 230 miles an hour and you don't respect him, you know, that's when bad stuff happens. One of the coolest things was when I was racing at Indy 500, I was in practice and I had uh, Elio Castroneves behind me. So I kind of just, I mean, he was gonna pass me anyway, but I kind of just let him go around me because I just wanted to like follow him. When he was alongside me, I just looked at him and was like, wow, you know, he's a three-time Indy 500 champion at Indy right now next to me. And I thought that was really cool. He's been there every day for me. He's there every session on my stand, just running me through things. You know, he tries to make my rookie step not so much a step, just making it as painless as possible. You know, there's gonna be some mistakes we make, but um, he knows that, Chip knows that. I know that and uh, you know we're just trying to minimize the big ones and he's doing uh, I think a very good job and you know I think uh, if I didn't have him or Chip or Scott or Tony anybody on this team really um, I think my rookie year would be a lot harder than it is. I am in the music uh, one of my big sponsors actually is Big Machine Records probably their biggest artist is Taylor Swift she's probably like my favorite artist of all time right now really I love Taylor Swift I'll admit it all right, she's awesome. I've uh, been caught singing a few of her songs, uh, like Shake It Off, like, probably like one of my favorites. Heartbreak is gonna break, break, break. <laughs> you know, and then like the whole part where it goes, I shake it off, shake it. Yeah, it gets me going crazy, I love it. I've actually been da going down the highway a few times and seen people have their cameras out as I'm dancing in the car with my friends and stuff. <laughs> it's, it's quite funny. <laughs>